Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Review by Project. I'm Psycho again with you today and in this one I'm Whoa. really excited on what we're doing. This is the final part of the Mass Effect, well final part, um, the final part of the original Mass Effect series. We'll go with that. Mass Effect Andromeda has been released after this one. So as you know we're gonna go to Mass Effect 3. Um, one of my, f well, I have to say my favorite game of the Mass Effect series um, for now, just because of everything that happens throughout this, um, throughout the game and throughout the series be before this. Um, so, let's just get on to everything. There's a whole lot of th things to talk about in this one. Um, we're just gonna go and start out with the story. Um, the third part of the Mass Effect pretty much continues the previous two parts with the Reapers and everything. So the third part pretty much focuses on the Reaper's attack on Earth and the other planets. So you, as Commander Shepard, must rally as many troops as possible um, to actually fight the Reapers um, and make one last stand against them to see how um, how everything unfolds. Can you beat them? Can you not? There are a... Sh I think there's about eight or nine different endings to the game um, that can be um, that can be achieved throughout the whole game. Um, there are a lot of different paths you can take throughout the game. You can be a good guy. You can be a bad guy. Uh, you can get all of your allies to work with you. You can get nobody to work with you and pretty much uh, not do anything, um, but the whole point of the game is to pretty much gather as much resources and allies as you possibly can uh, throughout the time that you have available um, before the Reapers attack Earth and lead all of them into a final stand against the Reapers on Earth. Um, and as I said, there are a lot of different endings, so there's a good ending, there's a bad ending, there's a neutral ending, but if you actually manage to collect um, enough troops throughout the game, this is pretty much going to be a spoiler, um, and um, involve yourself in enough multiplayer games to have the galactic readiness on a high enough level, you can you manage to defeat the Reapers and, spoiler, spoiler alert, <laughs> Um, Commander Shepard actually survives, but um, if I'm not mistaken, we have not seen him yet in a new game because um, Bioware actually announced that all of the games that come after this are not going to be um, related to the story of the m of the of this original Mass Effect series. Um, so if we go on to the gameplay, it's the gameplay has been kept pretty much from the previous two parts with a classic team based kind of an RPG shooter, well third person shooter game um, in which you can pick um, a lot of different classes and upgrade yourself to pretty much match Hello. your, uh, for the character to pretty much match your playstyle and um, get the powers that you want. The multiplayer actually, um, actually has a lot more yeah. power-ups, weapons and everything than the single-player mode, but even in the single-player mode there's enough weapons to pretty much suit anybody. Um, the graphics themselves aren't, well, aren't much to say about. They are really good, but they could be better, um, but I think Bioware decided on this one um, not to make them so so flashy and so so really good. Um, just because they know that there is a, there was a lot of people actually hyped about this game and made even the requirements kind of low so that most of the well, most of the players that have played Mass Effect 1 and 2 would be able to play the third part as well. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna recommend this game to all of you guys that pretty much love the Mass Effect series and love kind kind of a space-based RPG with a team that you can command at will and uh, customize your character to your liking with the weapons, with the armor, with the powers and with the decisions you make that kind of impact the whole game. It's a whole package and I'm not kidding. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much going to be all from my side for this one, and in the meantime, don't forget to like and subscribe, comment on the videos, and I'll be joining you guys in the next one.